Hey y'all, it's Mommy Wacha and I'm back. Thank you so much for your support of Mind Right Botanicals. Here we plant seeds to improve your mind, body, and spirit. So let's plant a seed for my Earth Sign Collective, Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn. Excuse me, happy birthday to any Tauruses that are celebrating today. Let's see what the Holy Spirit wants you all to know, what the energy is surrounding Earth Sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn vibes. Holy Spirit, what do they need to know from you through me at this time? Holy Spirit, please and thank you. What are the messages for the Earth Sign Collective from you through me? Holy Spirit, what do they need to know? Alchemy, Queen of Pentacles energy, for sure. Queen and King of Pentacles, alchemy energy, Earth Sign energy. Somebody may be practicing alchemy, an earth sign. Unicorn energy. There could be a unicorn energy who's alchemizing energy. Alchemizing their own energy to teach other people. Okay? Transmuting what they've learned into lessons for others. Okay? Evolving. That's what it looks like to me. That they've learned how to transmute their life lessons into teachings for other people. Whoever this unicorn alchemist teacher energy is, okay? They have used their testimony, their trials, their troubles, their tribulations, whatever you want to call it. Somebody name can start with a T. But they have used that to help teach other people how to expect better for themselves in their lives, to raise their standards, okay? So what do we need to know about this energy? What else, Holy Spirit? Please and thank you. Police. Intuition. Money is coming. Whatever this earth sign has advised somebody to do, it's about to pay off for them. They're about to receive an unexpected blessing. Something this earth sign said may have helped to solve the case. Some sort of intuitive teaching that this earth sign provided may have, prov may have helped the police solve something here. Conference, okay. They want a conference with this spiritual teacher. They may have had somebody else that they were utilizing to get intel, intuitive intel from, but whoever this person is, okay, they want to work with them now. They want to give them an offer. They want something new. Whoever they were partnering with before, they realized that that person don't know what they talking about because they've been having to eat their words, okay? So they had an intuitive teacher of some kind that was advising them, possibly about legal matters here. That's what it looked like to me, criminal matters. And ooh, and whoever they was utilizing, that person ain't wasn't on the up and up with their spiritual gifts and abilities and teachings, okay? And so now they want to work with whoever you are, unicorn energy, whoever this earth sign unicorn energy is. They want you to be their spiritual advisor. Favor ain't fair, okay? And whoever that they're firing, because they finna get ready to hire you if you accept the position, whoever I'm picking up on. But whoever they had hired before you, they, they getting fired. <laughs> that, I ain't trying to laugh, but that contract been broken because I'm picking up that this person wasn't really intuitive, okay? Like I have to help people understand 444 with tarot cards even. Just because you know how to read tarot cards don't mean that you intuitive. Don't mean that you have a divine connection to the most high God. 
And some people think because they can read tarot well that they're some sort of divine being or that they're intuitive and they have all of these, this spiritual ranking that they don't have, okay? And that's who these police was partnering with before. This is somebody who truly was not in this intuitive alchemy energy. They were perpetrating like they could do it like that and they can't they couldn't because something they didn't tell these people was fucked up and it was wrong and it put them in a in a rough spot we have soulmate now i'm gonna tell you something Whoever this other quote-unquote intuitive teacher is, intuitive advisor is, they may have had some sort of partnership with someone in law enforcement. And they were advising them. But this person is broken spiritually. It's out here. They, they ain't in alignment like people thought they was. And that that ended up being a, a parent in a case. I'm getting it. They over it too. I'm telling you. They ain't fucking with this other person no more. They want to give an offer to you, whoever you are, okay? Yes, they do, honey. Wow. Anything else from the I Be Knowing Oracle deck from my earth sign, Archangel Michael? I'm telling you, you are spiritually protected. That's why we saw that 444 on the clock. Because whoever this other person is that they were utilizing, this person may have been aware of their interest in you. And they may have been coming for you spiritually. That's also why this abuse of power is out here. Because they may have some spiritual abilities but this person ain't truly tapped in. And a lot of what they're able to do spiritually is through some sort of spell work. And they were even sending some sort of spell work at you so that th these people wouldn't want to choose you over them. Like they know that your name was brought up in some sort of conference as somebody that could do the job that they were doing. This soulmate police officer that they date may have even told them that. So they were trying to break you somehow spiritually so that you would not be favored for this position. But they fucked up. And I'm telling you, whoever they were partnering with who was giving them a shot, who, re who referred them even... He's hurt because he didn't put himself out there for this, this person that he was dating. Like they were some sort of on point advisor spiritually. And this person and got somebody fucked up. We got balance, but that's how the cookie crumbles. That's how the universe will get things in alignment, especially if this other woman was spiritually attacking you for your gifts and abilities. The universe was gonna send that shit right back to her. And that's what's didn't happen. Cause she looked real foolish to folks for whatever she claimed she knew was, to, was the truth, power. Whatever power she claimed she had, they know she ain't really got it like that, but you do. And you are protected. Protection is out here twice. Like she might have even been trying to pull your power to enhance her own. That's also why this alchemy could be out here as well. Okay? But again, they over it. The, the people she was working for, whatever sector of law or government that is, they ain't impressed with her no more. They're over whatever spiritual intuitive ability she says she have. And jokes is on her because I'm telling you that's what happened. This woman tried to pull from your power or either block your power so that these people wouldn't want to pursue you. And that shit got returned to sender. And whatever she thought she knew, 
that she informed them of, it was completely false. It was totally wrong. Sacrifice. And they didn't sacrifice her ass 10 10 on the clock. Because I'm telling you, she looked foolish. Whatever she said, however she advised them, whatever she claimed to be true, that shit was incorrect, okay? Anything else here, Holy Spirit? And then we're going to move on to the tarot. This person, look, we're a neighbor in here at the table now. Because when I'm telling you, whoever this other woman is, she knew about you. She knew about you being a spiritual advisor, a spiritual teacher. She knew that these people were looking at you. Looking at you as a prospect. Comparing you even to her. Okay? Because see, there's another man who was communicating with her man about what he was looking for. And he referenced this woman. Now, I picked this up on this channel, something similar to this, where somebody, no, it was the other channel, where they were supposed, it was a person in power, someone in law enforcement who was supposed to prosecute a karmic for what they did to a feminine, a divine feminine, but instead of prosecuting her, he promoted her. He got her position within that sector of government to do something similar to what she had done to you. And this is this is giving those vibes as well. Somebody was dating a spiritual advisor and they had this big bright idea to try to pull her into their profession to utilize her skills in that way, but it's been exposed and she really ain't even psychic, okay? And it is something like this woman may have been stalking you. This woman may have been spying on you even to try to see how you do what you do so she could copy it. 1221, when I looked up, they were arrested, child. I'm telling you, I don't know what the fuck she told these law folks, but that shit was crazy. And it, it might have even caused a sacrifice in their ranks. Okay, because if they were following her lead to do some shit and it wasn't right and it caused some sort of sacrifice or some sort of loss for them, she might have could have got arrested. Child, I keep seeing this HIPAA violation shit too. I have seen it about four times since we started, but I don't want to pull it. I want to see if it's going to come out on its own. But yeah, that might be why he hurt too, because she didn't got them fucked up somehow. She didn't got them fucked up somehow now. Shit has hit the ceiling. I'm trying to tell you. Look, MDK. So now this woman then told these people to go do some shit and she was wrong and somebody got unalived. They really on her ass. Do you hear me now? They really wishing they would have fucked with you instead of her. He loves you and her. And it's, and it's quite possible that whoever this person is that she was partnering with, whoever this police is, masculine, who thought she was his soulmate, you may have had some sort of connection to him as well. He might like spiritual women. But he chose her over you and he regret that shit, okay? Because this then fucked up something within their ranks. Clarify, please, and thank you, Holy Spirit. What else? 1414, I'm telling you. What else do we need to know from here? From this, please, and thank you. Now, if this woman then told these police officers to go do some shit because she knew intuitively whatever the fuck because I hear her ass, didn't know, didn't know shit, fudging, 1441, then told these people some shit, 1444, possibly put them in a position where they needed to be spiritually protected, because something happened here, somebody was unalived as a result of listening to this spiritual advisor's 
um, rhetoric, what she claimed to be true. And it's then backfired on these police. Eight of swords. Her ass might have got arrested for real. Because you can't be sitting up claiming you know some shit to be fucking true. 1515. But your ass lying. And you don't really know what the fuck going on. You you in there faking and shit. That's why people be picking at us talking about we miss Cleo's and shit. We don't know what we talking about. We gimmicking. We, we monikin, okay? Because we want to get monetized and shit. See, that, she might have done said that, all that about you. I don't know if you monetized on any platforms or not. But I know you the truth. And they know that shit too. Mainly because of how she done fucked up. So what else, please and thank you, Holy Spirit. Because I just got all of that. And that's crazy right there. I'm telling you, it's bad. These people followed this, this woman lead on something. And she done got them fucked up now. Two of Cups, Hangman, Seven of Cups, Ace of Swords, because she didn't know what the fuck she was talking about, y'all. I'm telling you. They took these visions or meanderings or premonitions she had as law. They made some sort of major move based off of what this woman said. Partnering with her has been sacrificed because she didn't cause some sort of sacrifice within their ranks. I'm telling you right now, somebody done lost their life listening to this old fake spiritualist that he was fucking and then got them fucked up now. Chariot, police. Don't that look like the police to you? They thought this woman had mental clarity about something, but she didn't with this Seven of Cups. And they they took action. Okay? Went hard, even, based upon what she said to be true. And that shit was not true. Ten of Swords. She caused somebody to lose their life based off of what she said that was not correct. Somebody that lost their life within these ranks. And my condolences to anybody who lost their life because this hoe was playing around with spirituality, acting like she knew what was really going on and she didn't fucking know what was up now. Because that's what's then happened. That's what's then hit this table now. And they really thought that this woman was on the up and up and shit. But see, you the real empress. And I'm seeing you right over here because whatever has transpired with this woman, it has proven that you are the divine feminine. That you are the true unicorn energy the true alchemist, the true divine teacher, and that that's who they should have partnered with from the very beginning. Cause I'm telling you now, it's still, even if he, even if he referred her, it was still some sort of debate about who they should choose. Like they was already looking at people for this position and he was like, Oh, I know a girl. Okay. But that girl ain't on the up and up. And that had, time has shown that. High Priestess, right here on the bottom. I'm telling you. You the true High Priestess. You have the wealth of knowledge. You have the insight and clarity. You, you are in alignment with the spiritual realm. And they use you to bring hope, strength, and renewal to folks. This your energy. Okay? High Priestess, Ace of Cups, Ace of Wands with the Star. They know that for a fact now who the true divine feminine is now. Because, see, they thought this other hoe was that. But look at her energy. Look at her energy now. This her real energy. So that she could, this her energy so that she could appear to have been who you were. 
But they see that now that it was a facade, that she may have even been doing something spiritually to appear in this energy to these folks. This masculine she was sleeping with, he feel the same way too. It's like her cover has been blown. With this MDK, shit has hit the ceiling energy. Whatever transpired as a result of what she fucking said, these people know she full of shit. Moon falling right up under the seven of cups. And lie, there was there's been a sacrifice of lives as a result of what she said. This she might have went to jail for real, y'all. Because you can't be out here doing that. You can't be out here doing that for some money. Okay, because that's really what is what it's given. That's why this money is coming card came out. Because see, they about to give you this offer that they had given her. And it was a it was a very lucrative offer. She was getting a lot of money for pretending like she knew what the fuck was going on. Now they want to give you this offer because they know for a fact that she does not compare to you. Anything else, Holy Spirit? That's a shame. Again, Seven of Swords. They know her ass. That's a shame. That's a shame now. And they know she was scheming and gaming to get this position. But she didn't want to look bad in front of her little soulmate police boyfriend. And now her ass sitting in the jail cell because that's what I'm getting. Like this person in jail for encouraging this sector of law enforcement to go and do something that has put people in their ranks. I'm hearing people. It could have been more than one life loss. My condolences again. But whatever she told them to do, it put them in the ten of swords. Whatever she encouraged them to do. She could really be a queen of cups. Because she ain't no nine of pentacles or no empress. You are. But she could have really really be a queen of cups. Because she did come out here as this magician moon with the seven of cups. Mm, mm, mm. Anything else? I'm about to get up out of this. Because child, I'm picking the devil. I'm telling you, I'm picking up on, the, on, the, on how dark... This woman is for real. That these this this police force really needed to protect themselves from this hoe. Cause see, if she been playing around in dark magic, moon magician with the seven of swords, two of pentacles, devil, whatever she been doing spiritually, then backfired on these people. Cause they was fucking with her. See, that's why I be telling y'all: be careful the company you keep. Be careful who you collaborate and conference with. Because if them people ain't on the up and up, whatever they sending out here, it's not just going to come back to them. It's going to come back to those that are around them. And that's what's the damn happen now. Again, my condolences, because I do feel like something has happened recently in relation to the police like that. In my area, matter of fact, but I don't advise the police. They ain't paying me for nothing. So it ain't me. It wasn't me. But it's somebody out here. Three of Pentacles that was conferencing, giving out false advice now, and then got people fucked up. Emperor, collaborating with an Emperor energy, this Queen of Swords, Queen of Cups, acting like she knew. What the fuck was going on? And ain't no shit now. Nah. But I digress. I digress, honey. I hope this message helps somebody. Because see, they know you chosen. They know you the one. They know you going to bring light to their situation. Because it's murky right now. But they hoping that she'll get them back. In this energy right here. If you accept the offer. And you, you're you willing to take a risk with them. Because baby. She she know better. Well no she ain't know better. Because if she knew better. She wouldn't have did this. I wouldn't eat. Look because that's where she at now. 
I wouldn't even fuck with it. If I knew that I wasn't on the up and up to be doing that type of shit, I wouldn't even play with these people. Because, see, she didn't play with these folks. And now her ass is in a jail cell and up under judgment. But if it doesn't apply, if it doesn't, I'm telling you, if it doesn't apply, though, let, ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Let it fly, though. If it don't apply, take only what resonates. Leave the rest, and I'll be back soon with another one, y'all. Peace.